light and shadow light we always have a question in our mind why can we see so many stars at night but only one star during the day stars are always in the sky but the sun being the brightest of all hides the other stars during the daytime it is the only natural source of light it helps us to see everything around us it also gives us heat at night we cannot see anything because there is no sun but we need light to see objects we get this light from different man-made objects like bulbs tube lights candles torches diyas etc the sun and shadows the sun is also the cause of shadows when the light of the sun is blocked by an object the dark area beside that object is called a shadow let us do an activity go out in the sun at different times of the day and observe your own shadow move in different ways and see how your shadow changes play games with your shadow the position of the sun decides the length of a shadow at noon the sun is overhead so there is hardly any shadow in the morning and afternoon when the sun is in the east and the west you block the sun's rays and your shadow is long in the morning your shadow is in the west in the evening your shadow is in the east you cannot see a shadow when the sun is covered by clouds shadows can be seen only in the presence of light let us have some fun with shadows use a dark room and a torch put different objects in front of the torch light and watch the shadows now by using your hands try to form shadows of animals on the wall try to touch something and see if your shadow touches it too now gently try to move your hand in such a way that your shadow continues to touch it now you know that you should not be scared of your shadow as it means that there is light somewhere near you hey you are going to tell me if the object that i am going to show you is transparent translucent or opaque are you ready very good but before we go on let's have a short review transparent it means all light passes through example of this is a window next how about translucent translucent means some light passes through an example for this is a wax paper and for the last one is opaque where no light passes through example for this is a door now are you ready let's begin look at this object this thing is this 
transparent, translucent, or opaque. Well done! It is transparent. How about this one? A wooden chair. Is this transparent, translucent, or opaque? Very good. It is opaque because no light passes through on a wooden chair. Next, how about this object? Is this a transparent, translucent, or opaque? Excellent. It is translucent. Only some light passes through. It is kind of see-through and it is not so clear. Next one. How about a cardboard? Is this a transparent, translucent, or opaque? Very good. It is opaque. Because no light passes through. The next one. How about this object? Is this transparent, translucent, or opaque? Well done! This is transparent. Very good! Thank you!